Internet services E-learning E-learning refers to the use of the network and communication technology in teaching and learning. The letter E in E-learning stands for the word electronic. You can use the information from the Internet in your work. It increases your knowledge and skills. E-learning has now been used by various companies, organizations and schools to educate and upgrade the abilities of their employees and students. E-commerce E-commerce is the buying and selling of products or services over the Internet. It is a kind of business on the Internet. News Groups a news group is like a notice board on a particular subject. Anyone can write or read a message. People may share their views with each other. Chat rooms. Using internet, you can chat with your friends, relatives in any part of the world. Emails. You can send messages and other documents by using email over the internet. It takes very less amount of time. Interactive Digital Television Interactive Digital Television allows users to interact with the broadcaster. You can download the serials, programs and also play games, etc. Advertising Advertising is the means of communication used to inform the people about a particular item or matter. You may find various links on the websites such as for buying any product or service. It helps you in saving your time and effort in procuring such items or facilities. Online games and music. You can play various games over the internet. You can also listen to songs radio programs, and even see films. Internet helps you to watch live TV shows or events and also cricket matches. E-magazines, e-papers, and e-books. You can read newspapers, magazines, and books online without having to buy them in their paper formats. Online banking. People may use the ATM cards for withdrawing the cash amount from their accounts. Advantages, Disadvantages of Internet Advantages By using the Internet, you can find any type of information on any subject with the help of search engines like Google, Yahoo, etc. You can buy and sell goods over the Internet. You can also pay bills, read newspapers, and send greetings over the Internet. You can easily download songs, movies, and play games on the Internet. You can fill online forms over the Internet. You can check the train, airline timings, and buy the tickets over the Internet. You can chat with your friends and relatives online. You can easily search and read books over the Internet. Disadvantages Virus threat is a big problem for your computer system. When you open corrupted websites on computer, there are good chances of virus attacks and this may give you a lot of trouble and will affect its proper functioning. Hacking is the process of illegally gaining access to someone else's computer system. The people who do this are called hackers. Despite security measures to prevent illegal access, organizations still have problems with hackers. Loss of personal information may be a major drawback of the Internet. Continuous use of the Internet is bad for one's mental ability.